What's going on, everybody? My name is Chris. And I'm Trey. We are the console freaks, and we are playing Watch Dogs. <laughs> and uh, last part, we got into this whole human auction place, and now we have to get out of it. Because we found what we were looking for. We got... We were able to scan Iraq's dog tags, and now we have to get out. And everybody's looking for us because um, they know. They know we're not Crispin. <laughs> he Silent just take takes down. everyone out. Jeez, calm yourself, kid. Silent takedown. Yes. Quote, um, unquote, silent. Yeah, quote, unquote, silent. So. What? What? <laughs> no, I was going to say, I, like, I think it's funny how they say it's silent takedown, but you can hear them scream. Yep. <laughs> of course. You know, in space, nobody can hear you scream. Ha ha. But they're not in space. So, on a scale of 1 to 10, how hard is this to get out of here? It's not really that, that hard. You just have to be patient. Just wait wait your turn. Wow. Whew. That was so close. <laughs> so close. <laughs> that just, is just turned around. What was that? Man, that was a huge rat. <laughs> yeah. I mean, like, seriously, that was I so gotta, close. I got to talk to Lucky Quinn about the rat problem here. <laughs> There's all these half-naked women and rats. Yeah, that's that. That must have been it. He must have been between the drugs that we all know that gang members do and the <laughs> the uh, the na the infinite amount of naked women that were around. Surely he's distracted with something else, which is why he didn't recognize you as a human right off. Yeah. Now this this part here this scared the crap out of me whenever I first played. Oh, like cuz I was, I just wasn't expecting there to be a cutscene. Like look look see this guy dies. That's what he gets. He deserves and it. And everybody is shooting at you. Yeah. Well, that was unexpected. No. I know you ain't disrespecting the squad. The squad. I know you ain't disrespecting the squad. Uh consider yourself disrespected. <laughs> yeah, for. <real. laughs> they can't do nothing about it. Cuz they're all dead. Shoot, you're much. almost dead too. Yeah, you actually. Uh, Did you fail? Did no, you fail this uh, I don't think so. I don't assume so. I hope not. <laughs> I don't know. Where are but you going? I was actually trying to find the exit because I I don't know where it's at. Like I had to, yeah, yeah, I had to find a way to get that that a door unlocked so I could yo, get out. Yo, I got something. Y'all ain't got okay. nothing. Y'all got right. death. That's what you got. Pow, pow, pow. Y'all going the wrong way. Y'all going the... Go the other way. Go the other way. See, that's what you get. You should have gone the other way. But no. I was you didn't want to help, man. It. You were just... So... Okay. I'm seeing a lot of these sections that have you hiding behind cover and more or less trying to fight your way out of things. It's reminding me a lot of... Ooh, excuse me. Of Ge Gears of War, or say, uh, what was the other one that I was thinking of just a minute ago? Um, Mass Effect. I didn't really play a lot of uh, Mass Effect games. So, I played so Mass really... Effect 2 probably 12 times. And I played the other two games at least once each. But, like, like, that's what I'm, play, getting. I'm getting. I'm getting a lot of Mass Effect vibes from this. Yeah. Like, I played a, a little bit of Mass Effect 3, but I never really played any of Mass Effect 2 or the first one. I I liked 2. I liked 2 a lot. <laughs> What's with all the cussing? Well, if you've got guys shooting at you, too, you'd be saying some naughty words, too. I don't, I don't hear Aiden saying any swear words. They're all in his... <laughs> he's like, psychotic, so he's... Of course he's calm. Yeah, he's he's just cool as a cucumber. This is an average day for him. He's like the pyro. <laughs> the pyro. What Aiden sees is completely different. He's obviously just playing, like, paintball. No, not paintball. Like, shooting a balloon gun. Not a balloon. What is it called? Chris, what's what is it called? What? Bubble gun. Yeah. <laughs> shooting a bubble gun at people. <laughs> A tickle gun. gun. That's all he thinks is just like one of those cap guns. 
where it just makes the sound and not the bu doesn't have bullets. Sitting around, skipping around, shooting everyone with a big smile on his face. Yep. <laughs> Shoo, you thought you could hide? Trey, calm down. <laughs> I don't want him to have this ankle anymore. <laughs> <laughs> you saw you saw me shot you shot him in the face. You saw me I saw shoot him, you in the shot face. him in the face. I saw. Just like that. But no, this guy's this guy's got a hard head. <laughs> he's just got half his brain blown off and he's just like I I'm fine. <laughs> I'm fine. I'm no way. I was so bad for you. Still can shoot better than you, though. Nah. Dang. He's dead. Of course. Um, overkill? <laughs> nah. Actually, you need... In order to kill the uh, the big heavy guys, you need an explosion that big. Was that a heavy guy? Yeah. Oh, luckily. Like, you, you'll you know them whenever you hear... Like whenever you hear, hear their voice. Uh, like, because they, they have, like, a... What's it called? Um, Probably a mask or something. Respirator. Yeah. So their voice sounds a lot different. They got the Darth Vader thing going on? Pretty much, yeah. Oh, he's dead. Oh, this guy just died. And it's also a good thing to have a crap ton of grenades on you at a, at, at a, at a time also. Frag out! Yeah. Because <laughs> sometimes, like, um, the enemies will change up at times, and if you keep like playing, sometimes they'll throw like two of those guys at you. I was like, really? Why would you do this to me? Because Be they're because <laughs> one is like hard enough. I to saw kill. what you did there. You assessed the situation <laughs> and decided it was not the best course of action. <gasps> Get him! Get him! Oh my god, so many screams! <laughs> the scream of agony. The scream of bliss. So at this point in time, the only thing we can really do is comment on what's going on. Yeah, pretty much. So, all, right. all that I'm, I actually die at this part too because uh, I just basically rush in without thinking and I get myself killed. I can see this happening. I see this as part of your future. I actually use this a lot. Whenever I played this through the first time, I never really used the uh, jam comms feature because I thought it was stupid. But no, it's definitely not stupid. It you is know, the best thing you could ever have. I've I've played so many games that have upgrade systems like that that like you ig you this intentionally this right here. ignore. Yep. Because you know it doesn't make sense to use them. It, it you'd think that oh that that's just you know, something you use. Why I keep yelling? <laughs> That's just something you use when uh, time to fuck this when guy up. you have no better way to take care of things. But like, I, I I keep thinking of Arkham Arkham City or Asylum. It doesn't matter. Yeah. Um, I keep thinking of those games when I think of like. You've got a lot of upgrades there that can be really useful if you use them correctly, but yeah. like otherwise you'll on your first playthrough you'll probably completely ignore. <laughs> this game seems very similar mm -hmm. to that, of course. And that and using your environment as well. Yeah. Environmental kills <laughs> seem to be uh, a big part of this, which yeah. I mean, I play Bullet Storm, so environmental kills are like essential yep. for for getting through that game. If you don't do environmental kills, you're screwed so badly. Heads up, Have you ever played Bullet Storm? I I've watched you play it, but I haven't Look played out, it beast. myself. That game Nobody is most fun to play fun. when you've been drinking. <laughs> I'm not I even bet. joking. I'm not even joking because like the as far as shooters go. It to me seems more simplistic and more um, <clears throat> less serious. It's oh, a lot what? less serious. So if you got a few drinks in you and you're playing that game, it's <gasps> hilarious to play. <laughs> like that that game. Uh, what kind of game is it? Is it like like a serious game or is it like Real serious bad. funny? Um. 
Let me let me see if I can compare Find it to that, something. Go. Yeah. It's It's kind of like if you combined the the kind of dialogue from like say Gears of War. If you took the if you took the dialogue from Gears of War. Yep. Removed all of the like emotional elements. Like all of the super emotional elements of it. And then replaced it with gimmicky gameplay and jokes. Yep. Like that's what it seems to me. Oh, okay. There's there's a lot of really gimmicky gameplay that makes it fun. Like to me, the gimmicks that they had were implemented pretty good, so it's fun yeah. to play. Um the dialogue, I mean, the dialogue and story, I could take or leave. It's, you know, it's not exactly what I would call a a masterpiece when it comes to writing or anything. Yeah. But it's certainly easier for me to dive into than something like, say, the story mode of Call of Duty or something. It actually draws you in. And the yeah. gameplay is fun enough to keep... To, to keep you interested, in my opinion. I mean, yeah. I, I know a lot of people that just can't stand it because of the uh, the trick shots and everything. Oh, uh, okay. It's it's basically a game based around exploring how many ways you can kill people and using your <laughs> environment and your weapons accordingly. I just smacked my mic again. <laughs> I'm sorry you out there in YouTube land keep smacking my mic. He's doing it on purpose. He's trying to make a... He's, try, he's trying to make a sick beat. Yeah, no. Where is? <laughs> but that—that's just it. I actually have the game if you want to try it out later. Oh yeah, yeah. It's a lot of fun to play. <coughs> Since I'm going to be spending the latter half of the next week editing and rendering. Yeah, yeah. Because all these videos. So many, so many videos are going to be going online. I that's why it good thing we're dedicated to doing this. <laughs> because we what? we've got a lot of stuff coming at you guys. Now this uh This actually, is all you still trying to escape yeah. from It take wow. it take it takes a bit of time if you want to actually get Are you gonna this finish it dying. before the end of this episode? Yeah, yeah. Good good dude. No need to drag things on longer than they have to be. Yeah, because I keep using my focus <laughs> so I can actually get the shot off and stuff, yeah. But it takes forever sometimes to get through some of these places because they have so many guards protecting the place. It's ridiculous. You have now? Yeah. And then he calls the cops on him. Going on at the Barrows and Brandon docks. Ooh. <laughs> like a good man. Good man. Yeah. He's going to blow the whole operation, isn't yep. he? Good. That's his I'm intention. So those girls yep. and get them someplace safe. As for those bidders, and he slipped past the bus, they'll end up on my That's good. Eventually. Aiden's a good guy. <laughs> despite the killing. Good guy, Aiden. See, I like this as a stark contrast to, say, Grand Theft Auto, where your entire premise is you are a bad guy doing bad things. Mm-hmm. And I can expose them I mean, for you what gotta, done here. you gotta steal and terrorize and, as Trevor, be crazy. Mr. Pierce, Jax has wandered oh. off. I'm very worried. This freaking kid. I was going to call the police, but oh, I wanted goodness. to call you first. <coughs> That's good. He does this who was, sometimes. Who was that that is calling him? Yolanda? Who is she? She's the uh, psychiatrist that's uh, in charge of, Please call me once you like, know anything. Um, we really should involve the police if you can't find Making him. sure he's, he's right in the head, pretty really? much. Okay, so he's she's his doctor. Yes, yeah, yeah. Jax would yeah. do this. He's not a so still. she's clearly Come great on, at her job. Like yeah, <laughs> I can't watch a kid, pretty much. But um, <clears throat> she she's like threatened to call the cops on Aiden so many times. <laughs> it's ridiculous. Yeah, I know. I've been seeing the uh, the. The conversations she has with him, she's not. She clearly doesn't like him very much. Yeah. 
It's ridiculous. See, that's a, that's, this, is, this is another thing that now I... We have to pick up Jackson. Then. We have to, yeah, go find him and see what the crap, what he was thinking. Kid, wrong with... I, I tried to find mom. There's men with guns here. Oh. I'm scared. Where did he go? How did he... Uh, this kid's smarter than we think. Like, for you. how is he able to find his mom, but super hacker Aiden Pierce can't find his own sister? Is is he with his mom? No, he's 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 somewhere completely different. But did he just find his way into a random gang? Uh, that's what I'm assuming. But I <laughs> I still don't know how he managed to find them. <laughs> I don't know. Just Kids. like go to the bad part of town, find the biggest looking guys there, and punch them in the crotch. <laughs> Where's my mom? <laughs> punch. <laughs> that's that's how we do it back in in the north. Trey, you're driving is immaculate. <laughs> this Mac, you can't, can't drive as I good can't as I wait can. Until you get your license. Oh, hey, I'm a better actual real driver than the game driver. Have you ever played driver? Have I ever played driver? Is that a game? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh I haven't played that in forever Chris you're going to have to play Driver now Is it like Is it an actual game or like a Flash game or? No it's an actual game It's like for um, What was it for Pl Playstation 2 I think hmm. <laughs> It's a uh, but you, you, Well It's kind of self explanatory You're a driver you do jobs as a driver Like not driving people but like Smuggling, and, and yeah, stuff like that. Sounds like Smuggler's Run. Oh my gosh, that's another game I haven't played in forever. Chris, we have to play Smuggler's Run. You record it. Nah, <laughs> this is yeah. Well then, nah, yeah, nah. <laughs> nah, yeah, nah. We're just gonna we're just gonna sit in the car now. Just gonna chill out here and um, on the sidewalk. This guy just walks right past us like this. He like slowed every up too. He he slowed up so much when he walked past us. It's really sketchy. Uh, now we have to get the. What the hell is Jackson doing in here? Racing. That racing van. Damn it! He thinks his mother's here. Oh, oh, that's why. This place is mobbed. Okay. After the auction. Because Racine was the guy. Remember, he was, he was in charge of taking his sister. Well, Damien ordered him to take his sister. Yeah. Mob owned. Yeah. <laughs> Eliminate all enemies. Ooh. <laughs> He's not playing around right now. So, so this time you actually are supposed to kill them. <clears throat> yes. You use your car fu. Supposed to kill them all. My gun fu. Your gun fu. <laughs> 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 oh, hello. <laughs> Just sitting there, gut shot. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not entirely sure if I actually die or not. I don't think so. I hope not. Oh, you got pretty close. Pretty close. I'm pretty sure you're gonna die. Now I do like um, in situations like this, the mini map is really useful. Yeah, because then you can see where everybody is. Yeah, like see where um. Jackson's safer in there until these guys are taken care of. I tried to like just take take the easy route, just like. <laughs> I'll just go up to where he's at instead of trying to take all these guys out, but I can't do it unless they're all dead. Too bad. <laughs> yeah. See, I was just going to let you guys live. I was just, you know, you guys got your families to feed. You know, I, I respect that. I understand that. But the game said no. <laughs> so now you all have to die. I'm sorry. So everybody dies. I like how whenever you shoot them in the head, they just... <laughs> they like, over. Dude. <laughs> I don't know. That sounds really weird, but yeah. Cool. There's another guy. He put up a little fight, though. <laughs> he tried. He's a trooper. Just do it! Well, if you really want to die that bad, I mean, yeah, we, can, yeah, we, we can arrange something. Is there a guy down there? What, fam? Look at you with your cover. <laughs> Thinking you so good. Who's that? Back up. Back up. Ah, crap. Don't you just love back up? Back up. <laughs> Did you see that poster? It was just a big F-U written on the poster. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
<laughs> That's great. Well, it could be worse. I mean, in Devil May Cry, the the reboot, it's written everywhere. Really? <laughs> Yep. Oh, that's great. In in limbo, apparently that's their fra favorite phrase. Ever. Just f you, Dante. D Literally bounced, bounced off of his off head. Of his face. <laughs> that's he great. Just, <laughs> I imagine that ding. Ow! I want these D's. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> Boom! You're dead. And now we get to finally get this stupid kid. Where you at, kid? Where you at? He's hiding. Oh! He's scared. I'd be too. Yeah. <laughs> and he saw him kill everyone. This kid is terrified right now. I mean, I, I understand. I understand. Mm -hmm. Especially a kid his age Come watching on, his uncle slaughter everyone in front of him. That's that's about as traumatizing as it gets. Yeah. Well, except for like... Because um, I'm pretty sure there was at least 15 people that just lost their lives because Aiden Pierce. Because my uncle went on a rampage. Just blacked out. Trevor. <laughs> if Trevor had kids. Face. The look on Jack's face. What did I do? What did I do? I killed every one of them. I killed what? every one of them. <laughs> what was I thinking? Whoa! That's not who I am. This is a lot. This is like... Is why get existential like this? It just makes me dislike the character. <laughs> this is not who you I know, am. You know... You know... This has just been the way it has been from the beginning of the game. Literally, he's killed people since the beginning of There's this so game. Much I wish I could Literally, yeah. Get off me! Don't you dare touch me! Did that five o'clock? Sorry challenge. about all this, James. <laughs> I know it's not easy. I mean, how? How would you talk your way out of that? Um. How would you calm him I down? I was saving you. <laughs> I did this for, for you. <laughs> Oh my gosh, what if he deal. just goes to her and spills everything? These bad guys. <laughs> well, my I uncle just killed 15 safe. people. That's what makes me strong. That's what makes me strong. It's pretty impressive. It's a good guy. Like the healer. And he got him to talk. I think he realizes the, uh... Yeah, you're just like that. The, the heaviness of what just happened. The game. So, yeah. I think he's come to terms with it. This kid's gonna be a little Terminator when he grows up. This kid, monster. He's gonna be a monster. He yeah. has a voice. He's he's already got the Batman voice down. I'm warning. Mini you. Batman voice. If I don't hear from his mother soon, I will call the police. Was that number seven? Seven? Seventy-two? Seventy-second time you threatened to call the police? Yeah, something like that. <laughs> this is the eighty-third. Nexus. Oh. Awesome. Oh, my Mission gosh. complete. Now, experience gain and all that stuff. And end of this part. So, yeah. We'll see you guys next time. Bye. It's time.